That's, yeah, that's quite a big, quite a big catfish. Let's get him onto the shore. Look, he's, you hear that? Oh, look, he's got my, try to show you this. He's got my fingers right down his mouth. All I gotta do is hang on to those gills. But these are the bits you wanna watch out for. The fins and these little barbs here. Stick you with those, it'll sting you. These spines on the pectoral and dorsal fins can cause severe wounds and they contain a powerful venom that causes extreme pain. And these guys just gonna hang on for dear life. Ow, 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 ow. Man, he's just shredded my fingers. That must be, must be 20 pounds of fish. Whew. Okay, let's see what we'll get off him. A catfish this size is a great catch and there's masses of meat on it. And the best bit is just the main fillet either side of his backbone. And look, all of that is great just to eat raw. Out here, the flesh will go off really quick. It's not worth risking food poisoning, so I'm gonna eat all I can now and leave the rest. But there's a price to pay for my fishing. Actually, one of its spines just nipped me. It's actually beginning to sting quite a lot. But one thing you can do to counteract it is just use ammonia. And there's ammonia in your pee. Stage fright. Here we go. The ammonia in my urine neutralizes the venom and helps ease the pain. And then I'm ready to go. Okay, let's keep moving. Out here, it's not just the animals that want to eat you. Even the swamp will try to swallow you whole. I'm out of the deep swamp and heading towards higher ground. But just when I think the going is getting easier, it gets a whole lot tougher. Really nothing in this swamp is easy. This has to be one of the wettest, stinkiest, most humid hell holes that I've ever been in. Okay, let's keep moving through, try and get out of all of this cattail. Cattail reeds are common in wetland areas. They grow thickly and their leaves are sharp, making them exhausting and painful to move through. What I'm trying to do is just use, use this stick to lay down the cattail in front of me and make myself a path through this. This is humid, humid, humid in this high grass. And this really is snake territory. Big time in here. I keep seeing flashes of things as well. Just be really careful. With the temperature up to 10 degrees hotter in here, dehydration and heat exhaustion are real dangers. So I want to get out of here fast. Man, thank the Lord for that. It's looking a little clearer here. It's such a relief to be out of that stuff, but in this place you've got to be careful what you wish for. Here you can be dry one minute, then back in the gloop the very next step. 